This is a new twist no one saw coming in the saga of music legend Vibes Cartel. He continues to fight for his freedom behind the walls of a Jamaican prison. Now he's found love and is focused on the future and a fresh start. But will he get the chance? Millions of fans of international superstar Vibes Cartel from Jamaica to the UK, from Africa to the United States and beyond, are watching closely what happens next to the imprisoned entertainer. By the end of 2022, he's likely to learn whether he will be a free man or spend the rest of his life in prison. Just last year, I spoke with Vibes Cartel in this exclusive jailhouse interview. You say you're in a better place mentally than physically. A lot of people would find that hard to believe. Yeah, because I, I was sick for a few years, so definitely I'm recovering physically, but mentally I've always been in a good place because I know I'm innocent and I know I'm coming out. Cartel, whose real name is Adija Palmer, has even more of a reason to hope the United Kingdom's highest court overturns his murder conviction. Her name is Sedem Ozturk. The couple confirmed to us they got engaged during the summer of 2022 during an authorized prison visit. Sedem has never spoken publicly until now. Did he actually propose to you? Did he have a song to propose to you? I mean, can you share some of that with us? Um, so how it happened is we were just calling each other hubby and wifey. And he was just like, we're heading towards marriage, so calling you wifey or you calling me hubby is not serious enough. So he was like, you're my fiance, we're going to, like, we're going to get married. Sidem tells me she studied psychology and was employed in London as a social worker, helping vulnerable adults and children. She left it all behind to move to Kingston to be closer to the love of her life. She's the muse for his new EP, True Religion. He's smart. I love his heart. He's got an amazing heart and it's just, it's so giving, it's so loving and I like to call him my angel. <laughs> so it's just, he's an angel in my life and I can't deny the way he makes me feel and how happy he makes me feel. So to actually be here in Jamaica, engaged to Addy, it's, it's a dream come true. I still haven't processed it properly in my head. I'm still, you know, it's amazing. I don't even know how to describe how I feel. That's how good it feels. Sedem began corresponding with Cartel in 2015, but did not have a chance to meet him until she traveled to Jamaica in 2019. These photos are from family visiting days at the prison. With Cartel in his second decade behind bars, it's been no ordinary courtship. It does cause some like, you know, difficulties. Obviously I can't see him every time I want to see him or I can't talk to him every time I want to talk to him. But when you know what you want and you know where your heart is at, it's not, it's, it's not that difficult. So I'm willing to wait. She says despite his current situation, Cartel's famous charismatic personality makes up for the fact they cannot hold hands or have physical contact during visits. There's a glass between us, so we don't get to touch each other. We just see each other and we've got to like talk through some little holes that are in like some little wooden bit under the glass. So it's not like, it's not perfect, but it's, you know, we're making the most of what we can. Um, the man I love, he's just like, he's so witty. It's like, even when you're angry or you're upset about something, he knows how to turn that around. And he can just make you laugh and just make you see the the brighter side of things. Since his conviction, along with four co-defendants, by a Jamaican court on a murder charge, Cartel has steadfastly maintained his innocence. With his attorney, Isop Buchanan, he has fought one legal battle after another, claiming he was framed by falsified evidence. A British forensic digital expert confirmed there had been evidence tampering. That gave them what they needed to take their appeal to the UK's highest court, called the Privy Council, which has agreed to hear the case. We are asking the Privy Council to throw out the conviction. Um, the men, all five, would have been innocent. In, and not, I'm, I'm declaring the innocence, but to, to add that several things went wrong in that trial. Sedem, like Cartel, believes the High Court will grant him his freedom and they can begin their life together as husband and wife.
love just wins. <laughs> he's just his love is so strong. It takes over everything. And to know Addy is to love Addy. While there was an engagement, there was no engagement ring. Sedem says she told Cartel she did not want one, but hopes in the future they'll be able to tattoo both of their names on the ring fingers. As for the case, attorney Buchanan says if the court rules in his favor, which could happen this fall, Cartel would become a free man and able to start his new life. We continue to follow this case closely, as I'm being told there could be sudden, unexpected developments. I'm Lisa Evers, Fox 5 News.